to create a quiz, click click on create again, come down to this assignment. This is going to be my computer hardware quiz. I also want to let my students know that this um, quiz is based on the lesson Computer Basics Part 1. I can develop my um, quiz from this blank in this blank form here, but I don't want to do that. I already have a resource for my quiz. I could have also gone here and click create and add a new um, a new form as well. But um, I like what I said, I'm just going to click add and load my Google Drive. These options are also useful as well. Quick um, attaching files or maybe links to a website or even a YouTube video that would um, help probably better explain topics so students can score better on the quiz but I'm going to leave it as it is and just click I can always search for the quiz by name by using the search the search here let's see if I can find my quiz computer hardware quiz and it appeared just here right here and my quiz is attached I'm going to leave my points as it is, but set a due date for today. And then place this under topic number one, computer basics. I don't want this quiz to be available just as yet, so I'll schedule this for sometime in the future. Let's say the 20th of April, quit schedule. If you notice that the items that are not yet posted in my classroom are grayed out, and the ones that are posted are, called, are not grayed out, they're still colored in. I can also rearrange how my course look here, how my content look. I can place my computer basic at the top since that's the first thing I want my students to see. And I would want them to complete my hardware, computer hardware assignment next. And after that, I my quiz should be ready by the 30th. If, if I do change my mind and I want to change my um, schedule for the quiz and bring it a bit because we are ahead of schedule for the course in general, I could go back, click edit, let me just go back and show you how I got there. So where you see the three dots, that means there's a menu or, or some options here for you. So you can just click on that, click edit. To change the schedule, I can click here. And reschedule again. Or if I think the quiz is ready, I can just click assign. And there, my quiz is ready, it's no longer grayed out. 